Good morning, YouTubers. This is a nice day here in Melbourne, and this is the start of our bonsai exhibition that we've been planning for many, many months. Here's the entrance into the exhibition area. We've got a nice little uh, mini Shohin display right here, and then we walk into the main exhibition area. I'll just do a really quick walkthrough. Well, no one's, no one is here. Hopefully you can have a see these trees in quite nice light. Actually, the light's really good. This looks like a jade tree. Magnificent, very large jade tree. I'll pick out some main trees. That's a prunus, a cherry plum. That will be fantastic in when it starts to flower and fruit. Now, one of the best Hinaki cypresses I've ever seen, especially in Melbourne. It's a bit dark to see, but that's a very nice trunk in there with the shade. Lovely Shema Cypress there, a nice tall, looks like a pine, but this thing is insane. It's a black alder, absolutely crazy tree. It is phenomenal. Beautiful trees on display here. So I've been promoting the show for many, many while. A nice native there. Um, let's let's show you the token armor now. Magnificent token armor we've we've had in the club with a black pine in the display. Let's do a walk around around the main around the um, open area, and here is a magnificent European beach. <laughs> that ramification is something else. You got to come see this tree in person to appreciate it. Lovely big olive. And now magnificent Mugo pine. Those those little candles and needles are so small. Look at that. Look at that beautiful tree. Very large cedar, Atlantic cedar. A this is a, a Australian native. Um, oh no, that's not Australian native. It's an actual oak. Looks very nice. Lovely little black pine there. A cedar group or spruce group, sorry, with some little mud men. In the passage there looks very cute oh look how gorgeous this little thing is wow tiny it's my, here's my hand for comparison <laughs> beautiful uh another looks like another cedar group of english elms some australian natives here's my trident maple on the rock now you can see against the black background it's coming up beautiful another another cedar this is a Chinese quince. Lovely Chinese quince. Very good. Still got some leaves on it. The ramifications coming up really well. An olive. A monster. Very tall. Looks like a cedar as well. Now it comes swinging down to the middle. Selection of trees. Here's, a, here's my little trident that I've been working on. Comes up really well in the background of the black. What's that? That's another spruce. We'll just do a walkthrough of this area. Um, I'll call out some main trees that I like. Wow, this is spectacular. A lovely Australian native tea tree. You've probably seen this in the convention, um, recent convention, Australian native convention, but it's beautiful there. Here's another desert ash, another lovely tree. Keep walking through. Wow, this is quite a nice tree. Very, very pretty little trident maple group. Ooh, very nice Chinese elm. Keep going around. And the juniper, cedar. That's an holly. Oh, gotta show you the leaves on that. That's pretty cool. Crepe myrtle, little juniper, another little juniper. This is one of my little guys. Put on a nice tall stand as it should be. Uh, the olive, one of the most beautiful trident maples. This is an import. From Japan when we could import it easily now it's much more difficult but have a look at that that is beautiful try to maple what is that a Kingsville box group oh that's nice this is a nice liquid amber another little shimpaku juniper of mine I wish I had a taller stand but I ran out of stands a cedar a flowering quince and a lovely, very small leafed olive. That is something beautiful. Look at that. Look at those leaves on that olive. Wow. Let's swing around to this side. A juniper there. Oh, wow. That's a liquid amber. That is a very, very nice liquid amber. 
A Japanese black pine, very big, very nice base. A little azalea. English elm, let's keep walking through. A little native there. Another Chinese elm. Oh, this, this Japanese maple three trunks is very special. Beautiful. What's that? Another English elm. This is lovely fruiting Catonia <coughs> Nice blue cedar. A couple more rows to go. We'll see how we go. Do a walk through here without catching all the names. Uh, my little black pine. Let's keep walking through. Always calling out my little trees. <laughs> There's my little um, shimpaku. Ooh, I think it got knocked in the in the move. Hang on, let me fix those little branches up. There we go. Just fixing it, making sure it's okay. A hornbeam, very nice. The only one in the show, I think. A hornbeam there. This is a lovely, beautiful coastal tea tea tree group. Very nice. My other little shimpaku on the right stand. Nice and high so people can see it. Try to maple group. A firethorn, a pyracantha. Wow, very nice blue cedar. And this is absolutely beautiful ramification on this Chinese elm. Look at that ramification. Lovely juniper. Keep going through. Chinese elm. A Scots pine and have a look at this malice or crab apple with the apple still hanging on there. Wow. And a lovely big English elm to finish off with. So just walking back, just this spectacular elder. It's just if you're in person, this is huge. It's beautiful. So there's the exhibition. Hopefully you guys made it down to have a look if you're in Melbourne. It's beautiful and very, very well set up. Hope you guys enjoyed that and hope to see you next time. Thanks guys for watching.